Welcome to a general overview video for Cardholder ID software. Cardholder ID is going to be compatible with both Mac and PC and work with all major card printer models from Zebra, Fargo, MagicCard, and Devilus. Cardholder ID is a one-time purchase with no reoccurring fees. Free lifetime phone and email support is also included with your purchase. If you're ever having trouble trying to print, don't hesitate to reach out. This video is going to be about the basics of designing your card. So let's get started by selecting the option here on the left, start using card holder ID. We're going to create a card yourself using the drawing tools, text image. This is going to open up the card types window. It's best to keep this drop down here on the top right on common card types. Most card printers are only going to be capable of printing on the CR80 size card and you can change the orientation between portrait and landscape orientation by using the checkbox at the bottom left. I'm going to select my card and click OK. This is going to open up my basic card editing window. On the left hand side of the screen are objects you can add to your card like text boxes, images, and barcodes. So I'm going to click on my text box tool here and click and drag where I want my text box to go. And I'm going to double click on the text box to update the information. So let's say I want a text box for first name and a text box for last name and a barcode on the bottom of my card. Same thing as the text box, you just select the barcode tool and click and drag where you want your barcode to go. You have a couple different options at your disposal to add images to your cards and card holder ID. You can use the browse image tool here on the left, select the browse image tool, click and drag where you want the image, and you'll be prompted to select where your image is saved. If you know where the image is saved on your computer, you can simply just drag and drop it onto your card. The beginner version of Cardholder ID supports standard 2D barcodes. Upgrading to the standard version of the software grants you the ability to create QR codes as well. Cardholder ID also gives you the option to select from pre-made templates. If I select File Open, I can select the template that I want. The beginner version of Cardholder ID has the ability to create an internal database for your cards, and the standard version has the ability to connect to an outside Excel spreadsheet. You can select the first and last name and any variable information on your card and make it so it changes after each print. For some more information on this, please refer to our database connection video. So let's take our pre-made template here and fill out some of the fields. And now we're ready to print. We can go up to the top and select the printer icon here or just do file print. You're going to want to make sure that your printer is selected in the drop down menu on the top left. And if you want to print on both sides, both print front and print back is selected. You will only be able to print double-sided if your printer has double-sided functionality. You can also access some of your printer driver options by selecting advanced options here at the top. When you're ready to print, hit the print button at the bottom and the card will be sent to the printer. That covers the basic steps for getting your card designed at Cardholder ID. If you're ever having trouble with the process, feel free to contact us. We're happy to help you out. 